hey what's up guys it's theo from Fino concept so today i'm going to show you how to get rid of http error 500 so let's just get started welcome to Fino concept click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our future videos so for this tutorial i'll be using google chrome but you can use whatever browser you want and i'll quickly go to our website which is finoconcept.com and you can see this page is not working and that is the error code right there you can reload it several times but it's not going to work so what i'm going to do is actually go to the back end of the website which is a cpanel and i'll quickly log in with my details and once i've done that i'll just simply go to the file manager and we will navigate through to public html so you go ahead and open it up now what we are looking for is error log so right click and go to view and in error log you are going to find what is causing the website from not loading so you can see failed opening required failed opening required and we are looking at what the problem is so in my case it's actually a plugin called jetpack that is causing this problem so you can see we have jetpack over here over here and over here as well it is basically running through the entire website and it's not causing it to run so what we do is I'll go into WP content, which is WordPress content. Then I'll go to plugins. Then in plugins, I'll find Jetpack and I'll quickly delete it right here. Now I wouldn't even send it to my trash. I'll just permanently delete it. And once I do that, I'll just go to my website. So let's open up a new tab, type in finoconcepts.com. And you can see the website is live one more time. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like to watch more of our videos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And as always, don't forget to share with your family and friends. This is Theo from Fino Concept. And I'll see you guys in the next one.